From starring in Hollywood films to founding an Irish whiskey and one that does good for the community, we welcome to the show actor, director, and founder of Slancha Whiskey, Liev Schreiber. Hi, Liev. Welcome to the Hi. show. Thank you for having me. So excited to talk to you because I just have to get the story. When did you decide that whiskey would be your next venture? Uh, well, I think it was probably in college. I, I, I didn't grow up with my father. And, and when I, this is not when whiskey would be my next venture. This was when I, I first realized that Irish whiskey was something that I truly loved. Um, but to answer your question about when I decided whiskey would be my next venture, was when a guy named Richard Davies approached me. Uh, we were doing a benefit for Blue Check Ukraine in Washington, D.C. And he, uh, he said he wanted to donate a cask of single malt Irish whiskey, very, very valuable single malt Irish whiskey. And I said, well, no, I wasn't really interested in being in the liquor business. But uh, when I thought about it, I realized that if we bottled this very valuable single malt, uh, we could sell it and give 100% of the proceeds, proceeds from that uh, cask to uh, Blue Check Ukraine. And we ended up being able to raise quite a lot of money for, for the cause. And this is ongoing, right? I mean, every time somebody buys a bottle, we're contributing to that right now. Richard agreed to do a dollar per bottle towards Ukraine. And so that's what we've been doing. And what we're hoping with Blue Check is that um, we are able to branch out while we're well, primarily right now uh, functioning as a as a humanitarian aid support group for ukraine we're also hoping that we'll be able to uh reach out in areas like turkey and syria and things like that and and do more uh, and certainly with slancha it's it's uh really helps very good I, I have to say that that's amazing what you're doing right now and that you know you get people involved to contribute in that matter now i've been watching your youtube videos with those little recipes for different drinks let's talk about that let's talk about you know you coming on camera and describe for the audience the flavors or the aroma the slancha has well not many people know this but after graduate school, I spent a few years working as a bartender uh, oh. in New York City. So I've got some skills. Uh, the bartender who helped me mix these cocktails would say I have no skills, but uh, I would like to counter by saying I have some skills. And I thought my espresso, uh, my cilantro espresso martini was, was pretty delicious. Um, I, for me, I'm a, I'm a whiskey neat drinker. I like it either neat or with a, with a, with a cube of ice. But um, I really enjoyed that espresso, uh, slancha espresso martini. I also love uh, slancha ginger, which is just basically a ginger highball um, or ginger with club soda. Uh, it's, a, it's a really, really super sippable spirit, and uh, I'm, I'm very proud of it. That is amazing. And I have to say, I did not know you were a, a former bartender and that you're diving back into that world. Because again, those videos are so much fun. And in fact, they're I did really fun to make. The problem is you have to be careful tasting too much. <laughs> they get progressively more difficult. As you can see, I'm wearing the same sweater in every video. So <laughs> by video number four, there's probably one too many tastings has happened. But listen, you're enjoying it and you got to found, you know, to uh, dive into the business right now, doing something good for the community. But, you know, I, I can tell that the whiskey is very versatile. You mentioned a different drink and, and there are different varieties right there. Is that is that how you would describe it? Yeah. I mean, you know, you know whiskey is a very particular taste um, uh, and it's, it's one that I love. It, it has a holds a lot of meaning for me um, for a number of reasons and memories that mostly involve my father. But um, it also mixes really well. And uh, for people who don't like that sort of uh, oaky um, caramel kind of bourbon cask taste, um, uh, mixing it with ginger is a great way to have it. Uh, uh, Slancha Manhattan is a delicious drink. Uh, Slancha, the, again, the ginger highball. Uh, there's also something called a paper airplane, which has uh, got Aperol in it and a few other things. It's, it, it's, a, it's a really, really flexible spirit. I do like that. And um, just, you know, I have to throw it out there. Will we see yeah. you in uh, coming up in a X men film or anything else going on in your career? Uh, yeah, I'm working on uh, something called The Perfect Couple with Nicole Kidman. Obviously, we just had a small light uh, uh, come out, which I still think is on Hulu uh, and Disney. Um, uh, and um, one day at a time, we'll see. Um, between between blue check slancha 
and my day job. Uh, <laughs> I've got a full plate right now. I know. And with Father's Day coming up, I have to congratulate you. I did see that Thank you're going to be a father again as well. Thank you. Yeah, it's very yeah. exciting. I'm, 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 I'm very excited about that. Yes. Well, you know, all the best, Slancha, to you because I know it means good wealth. Is that or good health, rather? Thank you. Yes, that's exactly what it means, Slancha. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Leave. And of course, we can find your Irish whiskey at different stores right here in the Tampa Bay area. Have a good one. Thank you so much.